Hey, my name's Natalie Rose, and the other day I went to Chatswood for a Korean spa treatment. Um, head to toe, scrubbing, steaming, sloughing, making you feel amazing. Um, <laughs> Chatswood has memories for me. I used to busk on the streets there when I was a kid. It's changed a lot. It's a business district, shopping district. Coming into Help Street, which is where a Rusu Day Spa is, there's a great coffee shop across the road for healthy smoothie, juice, or coffee. I just like their wall art. Um, Arusu Day Spa, it's very reasonable. They've got some really great therapists there. Just tell them if, they, if you like the massage strong or whatever, 99 bucks will get you anywhere from, you can stay two hours, three hours, you need at least two hours. You can drive, but parking is limited and it does cost. You might get a fine because you'll need at least two hours, but three, I bust it in, which seems to be the best way. Uh, it gets right to Help Street, which is where the therapy is. Um, fantastic way to travel. You can also go by train if you wanted to go shopping as well. They have most of the things that you need after your treatment, um, so you don't need to bring a lot. Maybe just a change of clothes, makeup if you feel like it. Afterwards, you'll feel amazing. I know I do, and this is about my fourth time there. I've applied now to work as a therapist, massage therapist. Um, yeah, fantastic vibe about the place. Afterwards, you'll probably feel a little bit lazy, so next door they have a Chinese place which does really healthy, yummy um, food, MSG free, grab a container for dinner that night, but then go find really healthy food in Westfields. I have found Flower Child, which is above the food court, right across from a bus stop. So uh, really delicious food, beautiful food, but nourishing, just what you need after that kind of treatment. You can stay for shopping, or if you feel good enough, just head on home and relax before the rush hour traffic. Want someone to take you? Call me, I'll guide you. Name's Natalie Rose, thanks for listening.